Hi guys, you can see me here in front of a bunch of Sinopolis cells. You know this here already, the 100 amp hour prismatic cells. They are used, as you know, and yeah, this will be part of my last pack upgrade of my AC Powerwall. And I can tell it will be definitely the last uh, cell upgrade on that power wall, on that battery system. That battery system is at the moment in a kind of sweet spot. It is serving just the right amount of uh, power going in and out. There will still be a slight uh, change then coming in winter but yeah this will then be probably the absolutely last upgrade on that power wall so i want to make this uh, cell upgrade before i have to leave again to stay in austria over summer this will be still in a few months but yeah it, you know from my last video every cell which is going into the pack will be tested and in the meantime i also got a internal resistance tester okay so as i said i still have a lot of cells to test this one is at the moment here it is getting very difficult to source these ones here i have an interesting story how i tried to find these cells since beginning of these years and it's such a cumbersome process and these cells now finally which i have here even these are from two different sellers here in thailand they're kind of overpriced i've tried to find them in, from directly in china as well i will tell you a short story uh, what happened to the cell market here in thailand if you live here and you are trying to find also battery cells what you can expect here when you are searching for these sort of items these are the cells which I already finished uh, testing all somewhere around 80 amp hours the lowest here is 76 highest 83 these, these have been uh, from the seller from the first seller so they are quite different a little bit and all others which are from the other seller they are all testing exactly 280 the internal resistance here the highest one 0.75 milli ohms and the lowest somewhere yeah, is this one here 0.49 so when they are new these cells the internal resistance is advertised somewhere at below 0.3 milli ohms so they are usually somewhere around double of the original value and if the original cell has 100 amp hours so they have as i normally mentioned already lost 20 percent of their health this cell here you know it is the bad cell which we removed uh, last time it measured to 70 amp hours but if you look at the internal resistance it has measured at 0 0.56 so it's actually by the internal resistance a better cell but yeah we have definitely identified it that it has a problem uh, with taking charge so for me the internal resistance value is a variable which does not tell me anything so if you know anything more about internal resistance then please tell me if you have been watching my channel you know that i have been buying this sort of cells already before so my first 48 cells i bought about three years ago and this was the absolute first time they have been even available here in Thailand. So I jumped on them. The, that time they have cost 1,100 baht. 
that's about 32 US dollars per cell. So you always need four of them to have one kilowatt hour of storage because as I said they have around 80 amp hours capacity left in them. Then about a year later I bought them already for around 800 baht per cell. So at that time they have been really cheap and a real bargain. Right, but when I uh, looked into this in January, there were no Sinopoli sales found for less than 2000 baht. 2000 baht that's about 60 US dollars, and for an 80 amp hour cell, that is just not the right price. So I was looking into other options, and option number one was. Because I have a lot of uh, Alibaba experience, because you know, as a hotel, sometimes I did some direct purchases from manufacturers in China for the hotel, for all sorts of stuff. So I went to Alibaba, and you can also find uh, companies there who are salvaging and recycling this sort of cells from probably buses or whatever uh, the source might be. So I found a company there. It was short before uh, the Chinese New Year. I asked them for a quotation. At that time I thought I will buy uh, 32 more cells. And yeah, they quoted uh, 25 US dollars per piece. So I asked them about the shipping costs, then the guy went to Chinese holidays, three weeks later he came back, he was only talking about his holiday anymore, I still did not know about shipping costs and then I just forgot it. In the meantime, uh, I have also looked into AliExpress, there are also shops which are selling this sort of uh, used sales, they don't tell they are used, that's a kind of common uh, story with the Thai sellers here and as you can see here they have shops which are selling these cells here 900 baht but there's two pieces of them or the other one here 660 baht for two pieces and that's also even including uh, free shipping and the shipping is done by DHL so you will get in, in one week. So all these numbers here will already let the alarm ring. If you have some experience with AliExpress and shops there, this would be like a free meal and there are no free meals as you know. So I have ordered two such sales and I used a store which did not uh, ask for this ultra cheap prices, so it was 1500 baht, so 750 free shipping to my door. And yeah, that purchase I made three months ago, and the sales, of course, are still not here and they will probably never arrive. So in about two weeks uh, this purchase will expire and I will probably get my money back. We'll have to open a dispute and that will be it again. So these two Chinese options have been no go at the end. So I was back to the Thai vendors and in the meantime the prices went down somewhere to around 1200 per cell, so that's higher than everything I had before, around 35 US dollars per cell, including shipping. So I received uh, my first sales, I tested them, I confronted the sellers about the cells not being new, not having 100 amp hours, they test out at around 80 amp hours. And you know, you're coming into discussions, of course, 
the second seller kind of a funny story. I have asked him about the sale conditions if they are tested before I purchased them and he said yeah, these are absolutely new sales tested 100 amp hours so when I have sent him the results now that they are actually have been only 80 amp hours he immediately sent me pictures that he is going to test now also he will tell me the result I did not get any results from him which means that my test a result was confirmed. I asked the seller if it would not be fair to the customers that they tell them what they are really getting. But he just answered to me and said, no other seller is telling the truth, so why should he do it? And that's like it is here in Thailand. So if you are planning for the first time to use such uh, sales from online shops here, in Thailand. Be aware these are used sales, they are over promising what you get, under delivering of course and at the end for this price 1200 you are already overpaying for it because if you go to Alibaba and you find brand new lithium ion phosphate cells 100 amp hours, I got a quotation from a seller there, he said he's guaranteeing 110 amp hours and the quoted price was 55 US dollars plus shipping, so maybe 60. If you would now calculate these old sales here to the performance of new sales, you would end up in the same price range and then you have a new cell versus an old cell which already has its three or four years. So yeah, you will be already better off if you directly buy brand new cells with the Alibaba distributor there. After I finish testing these cells, I will actually remove three strings of my power wall so 15 cells will be taken out and I will replace them by 15 of these uh, cells here and what I want to do is I want to test a sort of representative sample of the power wall of the old cells and test them as well for capacity and internal resistance because I did not do that before so I just want to know uh, how the pack at the moment looks like and once I have the measurements from those uh, 15 cells then I will upgrade the whole pack to a 16S uh, 6P configuration right and that configuration will then actually be it there will be no more future upgrade of the pack because you know you cannot just continue and add uh, more and more cells in parallel the bus bars are getting too long so it, it doesn't make more sense like that and I also don't want to um, put a parallel pack or something like that to that uh, power wall it's quite compact now it fits exactly to its purpose so late in the future if I need more battery storage, I, I can just put it somewhere at a sub panel, let's say at the garage, just remove energy directly from that string there and push it back into that face. And that should also suffice, that should be okay. It will take another few days to check out all these cells and then after now the Thai New Year festival which is a lot of work for us anyways uh, when this is over I will then make the final cell upgrade on the power wall so it should be some time in a few weeks then okay so that was it for today you saw it's uh, getting a little bit tricky also with these used cells so thank you for watching please comment subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet and I see you next time.